Yeah, my name is Councillor Andrew Scott and I'm the Cabinet Member for, with responsibility for Health and Partnerships. Well, we've, yeah, we've received uh, significant responses through the website in particular from the public, from individuals, uh, members of the public, but also from organisations and uh, we've had responses from our health partners, we've had responses from the police and they've, they've really helped us uh, shape the way we, where we think about the budget. And I have to really mention that Citizens Advice Bureau, they had a petition where they raised a significant number of signatures, over 3,000 signatures, which we've, we've, which, we've, uh, which we've received. With regards to public engagement, um, the Council has held uh, a number of public meetings where the Cabinet have uh, presented all of the, 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 all of the proposals and hundreds of people attended those meetings. The Council has also set up a website where it's been very easy for the public to engage and to be in terms of drilling down and looking specifically at what the proposals are and being able to respond to those proposals. With regard to my own involvement, I've been holding meetings within my own ward, talking to members of the public and actually just getting their opinions and, and really responding to their concerns. So the changes to the proposals in within my portfolio area are regarding financial inclusion and the social fund. We initially had a, a, an ad back proposal of £50,000 for financial inclusion. We want to widen that out now. As we've heard from the public, we know how, how important financial inclusion is. And by that, I mean things like welfare and benefit advice. And um, so we're going to increase that and we're going to wrap that up with some of the social fund um, so areas in terms of uh, providing some of that low level of support. Yeah, this is a really difficult budget. Um, there's some very, very difficult decisions to be made. Um, if in my area of responsibility, it's all about people, it's all about health. And it's very difficult to balance that out against some of the big iconic issues out in the, in the community, like, like the library. That's hugely important to people. But in my area, it also it goes down to the indiv individual and what support and services they're getting. So we have to, be, we have to, to understand that. We have to understand the impact on the individual in my, in my area.